What's poppin' dumb and out gang? We are back at it with another reaction. We are back at it with another banger. And last, well not even a week ago, let me actually look up and see. Yeah, three days ago I tried to upload a BTS video. It was gonna be mic drop on Black Swan, the live performances. I did them three for a dance performance, I mean a dance practice like two weeks ago. Y'all love that video. Y'all said I should have checked out the live performances. And I did check out the live performances and YouTube blocked the video sadly. So I asked y'all is there anything that they don't normally that they don't that they're not gonna block that y'all want to see me react to? And y'all gave me another performance, which is the Tiny Desk performance. Now I have never seen the BTS Tiny Desk performance, but I have seen a lot of other artists at the Tiny Desk performance. I've seen Bruno Mars, Anderson Pac, I've seen Little Dirk and Chief Keef. Y'all might not know who those people are, but I've seen both of them. Lil Dirk's one of my favorite rappers, American rapper. And he performed his songs like on like I'm trying to think of the word like when they did it they had a whole bunch of instruments like he like the song that is on a trap beat but they switched it up on like jazz music type of vibes so I've already seen a couple of Tiny Desk performances so I, I already know what to kind of expect but with BTS you never know because BTS obviously is way more musically creative than all those people that I named. Well, I don't know about Bruno Mars and Anderson Park because both of those guys are legends. You gotta give respect to them. But anyway, we're gonna check this out. They're gonna be performing three songs in this. They're gonna be performing Dynamite, Save Me, and Spring Day. Now, I have heard Dynamite, but I've never heard Save Me and Spring Day. So this will be my first time hearing them two songs. But I already know about Dynamite. That's just a super like uplifting, positive song. It just puts you in a good mood. It's really like a celebration song in my opinion. It's just something to have you smiling in a happy good mood. But anyway, we're going to check out this Tiny Desk Life performance. We're going to hop straight into it. I need all of y'all to comment down below and let me know y'all's bias. And yeah, let's hop straight into this video. Make sure y'all stick around to the end. And this is from four years ago actually. NPR music. Okay. But I'm, I love the outfits. The outfits are like, they're sort of reminding me of like a super like funky club. Y'all remember how back in the day, how they would have this, the funky clubs where like you would wear the big afro with the glasses, like what RM has on now actually on the screen. Cause it'll be those same type of glasses. And then you'll also have the shirts cut like that with the super funky designs. It's like disco type of clubs. If y'all know what I'm talking about. If you're from America, you should definitely know what I'm talking about. But that's sort of what this is reminding me of, like the vibes. Ooh. Oh, let's get some subtitles on. Let's get some subtitles on, okay. Ooh, the bedazzled microphones. Is there a meaning behind that? Is there a deeper meaning behind that? Let me know. Because uh, some artists do that. Like Sabrina Carpenter, she has like certain microphones that have a special meaning to her. So do these look like that? Because these are not regular microphones. And they're all matching the earpieces. It's the little stuff, y'all. Ooh. He said, I got the medicine. Keep your eyes on the ball. Or he gonna take it from you. Overload, I'm into that. I'm good to go. Did y'all see his facial expression when he said that? Look at his eyes, y'all. 
Y'all see on. how he did that, bro? The, bro, the, the, pre, the stage presence, even though they're not on the stage. Like, just their performance, like, when they're performing is insane. They really get into it. Y'all see what I'm talking about with the celebra- I know I'm pausing it way too much, I apologize, I'll let it play out. But do y'all see what I'm talking about with like the celebration vibes? This is just like a super positive, happy feeling. No, not the ad. No, not the ad. Not the ad. <laughs> y'all seen, seen that smile he did after that? Nah, these boys are too funny, bro. They're having. You can tell they really love being around each other and they're having an amazing time. Bro, the way that they give 100% effort, even in an environment like this, is just insane. Life is dynamite. Life is dynamite, y'all. I love his voice. Oh yeah. Y'all yeah, heard how you just said oh yeah so deep after singing high pitch. Okay. Here we are. Yes. Yes. We just play our latest single Dynamite. Oh. It's a disco pop track that we simply wanted to share great energy to everyone around the world. I yeah. knew it y'all because I was saying earlier about the, dis the disco vibes off of the outfits. It's the first time. We are performing Dynamite yeah. with a live band. Yeah! Shout out to the live band. Now, I don't know any of the names of the live band. If y'all can inform me, or is this just a random live band, or is this their Pacific band? Because I don't know anybody in the band. I just know the BTS members. So y'all can inform me in the band if y'all want to in the comments. I would appreciate it. And we are very, very, very honored and excited. Yeah! That's right, we hope everyone could also enjoy our tiny... But I love his deep voice. RM got such a deep voice. I love deep voices. Save me. Yeah. Save me. Hope you enjoy it. Here we go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I've never heard this song before, y'all. Are you ready? Are you ready? Hey, can you hear me? Let's go. Yeah, I've been bumping his solo album crazy. His new solo album is insane. Ooh. He said, save me because I can't get a grip on myself. I need you to save me. But y'all hear the beat just picking up, bro. It's about the build up is insane, bro. The build up is insane. So 
Okay, sugar. Hey, but this is why I like him so much, bro. Because he went crazy on the cypher. Y'all know I love his song, Girl of My Dreams. He has crazy bars. I mean, so does J-Hope and so does R.M. Yo, and this is without auto tune too. This is their raw vocals, and it's so beautiful. That's really the only word for it is beautiful. Save me. This is another one of those songs where it's just like a super positive, happy vibe. Just something to make you smile. Or it might just be the way they're performing it. Now y'all see how they got up and started dancing? That was funny. Hold up. Look at that. All the guys just started dancing for him. To the dog. Thank you. Save me, save me. I need you, let me fall, fall, fall. Thank you. Ooh. Wow. It's been a while since we've seen you. It's been ages. Thank you. 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 Wait, so is this not the original version of Save Me? I love this version, but if this, if this is not the original version, let me know. So they do take this band on tour with them. Okay. See, I, I've never seen this band before. I have no idea who's in the band or anything. So I need y'all to inform me on these people. The next one is... Spring day. Spring day. We live at such difficult time. Like now, we all are wishing for the spring day. Hold up, I gotta speak on that because I just, I literally that just clicked. These guys have been talking in English the whole time, and none of them like their regular language is is English. I want to learn other languages so bad. What language should I learn to speak? Yo. What would be a good language for me to learn to speak first? An easy one. We got spring day. It's been the roughest summer ever. Facts. But we know that's spring. Was this recorded during COVID? Was this during COVID, y'all? So let's go together. Facts. Winter ahead. Ooh. Ooh. He said, even uh, even though I'm looking at your photo, I miss us. Time is so cruel. I hate us. True, y'all. Time does not play with anybody. Time is not waiting on anybody. Ooh. Ooh. He said it's always winter here, even during the summer. Oh my y'all know about that, but if you were going through it, the heartbreak too, every day feels cold. Nah, I love this, y'all. Y'all, this is a song I can actually like get 
like connect with you feel me Hey, he's how long he got away? How many sleepless nights does my man have to go through just to see you, girl? Just let him come see you. Miss you, Army. This must have been a gift for the Army because I feel like this was during COVID. So was this like a gift for the Army? Because they did make a lot of music for the Army while going through COVID. I ain't even gonna lie. I don't know every like group in the K-pop world, but I feel like BTS does more for their fans than any other group. Cause I am, I am mostly like, I mostly am into Blackpink. And I feel like BTS does way more for their fans than Blackpink. But Blackpink still does a lot for their fans. Don't get me wrong. I don't want no blinks in the comments talking crap to me for saying that. But I just feel like BTS does so much for the army. It hurts less to blame you. No. Damn, uh, what y'all know about that? Telling her I'm, I'm forgetting you. But really, you just thinking about her all day long. Yo, this song is hitting so hard. Y'all, this is my favorite song that they've performed so far out of these three songs. This is definitely my favorite one. The, the emotions in this song is just crazy. Let's get through this cold winter, y'all. Let's get through this cold winter together. Until the flowers bloom. Nah, I gotta clap it up on that one. Thank you. Thank you.
No, thank y'all. Thank y'all for putting me on. Thank you for joining us, everyone. Thanks for having us, Tiny Desk Concert. Woo! Thank you, RT Army, as always. Miss you all. Here we are. See, that's why I love yeah. BTS. Y'all see how they're always shouting out ARMY? All throughout this video, they have mentioned the ARMY. Thank you. Love you. They, I was seeing that in the guide. They never do forget to mention the ARMY. They never fail to forget that without y'all, they would be, you know what I'm saying? I love it, but I love the Tiny Death performance. This was amazing. If y'all enjoyed this, please make sure you hit that like button. Please make sure you hit that subscribe button. We will see y'all later. We got more bangers coming soon, so y'all be on the lookout for those. Peace.